welcome back to another snail mail video. So I finally collected from the P.O. box since my birthday and you guys, oh my gosh, there was so much in there. I couldn't believe it. I had to like carry it in my arms back to my car. So I'm so amazingly touched and I cannot wait to finish getting through the mail so I can start writing replies, sending off mushrooms to people who ordered them, and just in general like sitting and basking in the enormity of having such a huge effect on so many people's lives. So without further ado, I'm going to jump into the pile because I want to try to make sure I get through it pretty quickly this time. I tend to ramble and ramble and ramble. And this one is actually from Skye. And yes, Sky, I will uh, take care of that mushroom for you and send it your way. And oh my goodness, this is so cute. <laughs> Look at that Evie. Look at that. Isn't that adorable? The Evie is chasing that little Oddish and nibbling on its leaves. Oh, that's excellent. Line drawing, too. Oh my gosh. Oh. I messed up two times, and I must tell you, oh, no, it's so fine, it's fine. This looks amazing, if you ask me. So this is an adorable Oddish on top of a bay leaf. Isn't that so cute? I love how into Pixelmon you guys are. I need to do so many more Pixelmon Ranger episodes, I swear, because you guys just come up with the best things. I love it. Thank you so much, Sky. It's wonderful to be able to see some of the artwork that you do, and I'm really excited to be able to repair everything and get it over to you. So I cannot wait to get these up on the walls. That's the cutest. I love Leafeon. Leafeon, I, I said Evie, didn't I? Leafeon is absolutely one of my favorites, so I'm very excited. All right, now let's see what this one is. Airmail. Australia! Holy moly! It has a little flower on the back. I wonder what kind of airmail from Australia this is. Oh, it has a little spot to open it right here. What's this? What is this? Let's gently pull it out. Oh my gosh! I see lots of little stickers. Oh, look at this! Look at all the cute little stickers. Isn't that just the best? I love the twirly vines. Those are so pretty. Oh my gosh. Oh, you guys. Look at the little rabbit. And the koi Oh my goodness, the little rabbit. That is so cute. I'm going to have to put it up with my other decorative pieces up here. Oh, whoa. What are these guys? Sunflower teddy bear. No way. Oh my gosh, I've never seen Australia on the back of a sea thing before. That is so cool. Ah, oh, that is so cool. That is just awesome package in Australia. They are teddy bear sunflowers, which I really love. I'm going to try growing some of those in my pots this year. I've got so much because I want to take them with me when we move. Oh my goodness. Sunflower seeds in honor of sunflower and aster seed. And look at the cute little drawing. It's got sunflower and aster seed right in there. Oh my gosh. Now I want to like do a special episode with those two on like a romantic chocobo date. That would be adorable. Let's see what we have inside this letter. All right. And some of it I might have to read privately. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Brooke. You share the same name as my sister, actually. Oh, and I'm going to read this privately, but I will show off the amazing birthday hibiscus. This is like celebrating my birthday all over again. This is amazing. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this precious cat. Look at these cats. Or two cats right there. I love it. Look at them. Look at them. Oh, 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 this is so cute. Look at this rainbow oak tree. Mixed in with magic leaves and vines growing. Isn't that the most precious thing? Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you so much, Brooke. I cannot wait to get those seeds planted. Hopefully you can keep track of uh, them being planted and grown over on our, our like, vlog channel where I put all my gardening vlogs and hopefully they'll take off. We have some elegant singing in the background. He is in a good mood today. But, oh my goodness, and the cute little bunny. Thank you. Thank you so much. 
so much. I'm going to keep all of that right there. I will write back. I am going to try to write back to everybody I can. Uh, it might take a little while. There's a big backlog and I need to kind of, I need to get more letters actually. <laughs> I'm out of letters and stamps so I need to go get more. Oh my goodness, but to be able to talk with all of you. Oh wow, thank you so much. Urgent. Please play a Pichucraft or Pixelmon server. Read carefully. Royal Mail. Where's this from? Let's open this up and see what is hiding inside. I need to figure out how to open it up. It is taped up and sealed very carefully, very nicely. Aha, there we go. There we go. So let's see what's hiding inside here. It's marked urgent. Is it, is it like some sort of... Ooh! Some sort of dramatic biological mystery? What do we have going on in here? There's little beads and everything. Oh, look at this. I want to do this. I definitely want this to happen. So the little beads seem to have popped off in some places, but I can see where the glue was. But you guys, look at that. Look at the, the Magnum, the bay leaf, the Chikorita family. That makes me want to jump on Pixelmon and make sure, make sure that Ashleaf gets his family soon because that is just beautifully precious and really well drawn. I don't think I could draw a Chikorita in its evolutionary types if I tried. Whoa, what's going on down here? Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Look at all these Pokemon! You guys are amazing! I am going to really dive into Pixelmon Ranger because like everybody is so in love with the Pixelmon. Oh my gosh, and dinosaurs! This is so going on my wall. Oh, I've got to show everybody. Oh my gosh, look at these. Look at these dinosaurs. That is the most amazing thing ever and will actually help me learn some of them. I am going to, oh, there's even a little flame. There's a little flame for the volcano and a little egg. Oh, and look at this one. Oh, my gosh, and the drawing of the trees is so nice. Oh, and they're so soft. I like these stamps. Holy days. Or these stickers. If I knew where to get these, man, I would get a ton of them. Look at the Ammonite. Okay, this is, I'm going to have to, like, in a frame on my wall or something because this is the most precious thing ever. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. And let's see what's going on down here. These stickers are like the most A plus stickers. There's little tiny mushroom stickers. There's like a koala sticker. <gasps> look at the lizard sticker. Where are these stickers from? They're like, oh my gosh, look, there's Lab Chicken. <gasps> this is amazing. And there's little porcupines and a little like panda. Oh my gosh. Let's see, da, 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 da. my favorite color is green like you. However, I love almost, I love purple almost as much as I love your videos. Oh, we've always liked tigers. Oh, I know who this is, I think. Oh, unicorn. We've been working in the Facebook garden together. Oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah, don't worry. I'll, I will be working on that. Like I said, please give me a little bit of time. Unicorn, I'm going to be quizzing you about where these cute stamps are from because, look, there is an antelope. These are like the best stamps I have ever seen in my whole life. I'm in love with them. <laughs> oh my goodness. And yes, 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 I do see this. This is kind of amazing. I will be getting the interns uh, over there pretty soon. So, my gosh. So many interns, so many new people, so many stickers, that is so many good drawings. I'm going to have to like sit down later tonight and just kind of stare into space and be like, look at all this talent, people's talent and skills that is just like converged into my home. It's going to be the most amazing thing ever. Honestly, I cannot think of anything I would rather have up on the walls than the drawings and the pictures and the inspiration that you guys have sent to me. Because to me, that I just look at it and it's just amazing passion and, and happiness. And I can't wait to, to add to my, my hallway of fan art now. I'm so excited. All right, let's see what's this one. Nora. Oh, and there's like, there's a cute turtle on the front and a cute kitty. Look at that. A little hermit crab and a dolphin. 
Look at all those guys. All right, let's get in here and see what's going on. I want to make sure I get through the packages in a timely manner this time because I tend to drag these out way too long. All right, I just get so happy and excited. I want to make sure you guys know how much I am so appreciative of what you've done. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this kitty. And there's turnip head and his pumpkins. Look at this. Oh, that's adorable. That is just like the cutest cat ever. Oh. From Nora, Major Calhoun in the window of the staff lounge. That's what I thought. And stay curious, Nora. Oh. Oh, wow. I'm so glad you like the Farmville series. It is over on uh, my, my vlog channel now, the Farmville series, so that it doesn't clog up the main channel. But I do try to do it every day, so I do try to put Farmville out every day, too. And this is... Oh. Now I have, like, pictures of like Nightlock, I've got pictures of Agent Noodles, so this is Persephone I believe, no no this is Major Calhoun, that's right, from this perspective. So now there's Major Calhoun and Captain Kaz, and I'm gonna have to have like a cat wall now up on my wall, because that's just gonna be amazing. Look at that. Thank you so much Nora. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, just... There's lots of noise in this one. This one is from Logan. Apparently it's open. I hope everything's in here. Like, I didn't open it. Whoa! Whoa! What's going on in here? I got when we were on our four-day rafting trip. The shell is from the uh, Salmon River in Idaho. <gasps> is there a shell in here? Oh my gosh! <laughs> There's a lot of stuff in here. Hang on. Alright, let me gently open this up. Put the dino in the water. Amethyst is my favorite crystal. I love amethyst as well. Let me gently slide all of these little amazing presents out. Come here, you. I see you in their quartz. You come here. Oh, I think it's one of those little grow dinosaurs. We might have to do a special little vlog where we grow him because that is just precious. And look at, whoa, this is a nice, nice seashell. Look at this. You can see where the clam shell has purple on the top and then it variates in color, probably due to age and whatever sediment that it was laying in at the time. You can also see a lot of uh, pitting, which is probably from like rocks and things pressing into it over time. Speaking of rocks, here is some beautiful amethyst, gorgeous amethyst. I'm assuming some nice quartz, really beautiful quartz. I have tons and tons and tons and tons of crystals and rocks that I collect, and these are some beautiful specimens. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna enjoy putting these with my, my group. It's Logan, right? Yeah, Logan. Oh my goodness. What's going on in here, Logan? What do we have? I see little drawings. Oh, is this a dodo or a duck? Hang on now. Oh, oh, my finches. Look at that. Me and my friend made an entire encyclopedia of an animal we made up called a snitch. Zoo crafting snitch. It is like a kiwi, but different. So this is a snitch, and I love that. I actually used to come up uh, with like made-up animals all the time. It's actually a great way to research biology. That's why we play with learning biology on the Pixelmon Ranger channel all the time, is because it's a great way to apply what we know about real-world biology into a fictional setting, which is a great mind game. It's a great way to try to think about how animals and nature work together, how they interact. Uh, it's a great way to really mentally stimulate yourself and also teach yourself real world apical biology things. So I totally applaud making up animals. Totally my thing. I love it. Littlefoot, Sunflower, Aster Seed, Bambi, the Pleosaur Nami, Pebbles, <laughs> Hey Bye, the, uh, the Panda, the Bamboo Rats, Oh my gosh, and it's all of, it's the Calican and all of the cats. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this snail mail. Dear Siri, my name is Logan, and I am a cancer survivor. I love your videos. I am 12. Ha I am 12. Happy Easter. I love your zoo crafting series. When I uh, comment, it is 
Oh, two bros, yeah. Yeah. I know who you are. Oh my gosh, and there's red. Look at all my animals. Oh, look at these guys. The whole family is here. That's amazing. Oh, Logan, thank you so much. I really, I know who you are, and I love seeing your comments. Dr. Turtle MD, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm going to very gently fold this up, put it on my wall, the, the snitch kiwi bird, and then we've got a couple, couple other things down here from Logan. Mix pack mystery. And I think these are seeds, so I'm going to have to be very careful, make sure that I don't have any that they're going to try to pop out on me when I open this. Let me gently, uh-huh, I saw you, buddy, trying to sneak out. Oh, look at this. It's a mixed pack mystery of seeds. I think I know what some of these are on site, because I see them every day in my bird seeds. <laughs> but this will be fun. I'm going to see, I might plant these out in the secret garden and just see what pops up. So that would be really fun. Uh, Grandpa's Magic Beans. What is this? This is interesting. I feel like I've just been given like Jack's magic beans from like the beanstalk story. Jack and the magic beanstalk. <laughs> some pinto beans. Some magical pinto beans. Check that out. I love beans. I, I really do. I love eating beans. I love just the look of beans. They're fun. Alright, and this needs lots of sunlight and water. And there's even like little little like recommendations on the back. Look at this. This is these are custom seed packets. Logan, that is amazingly creative. I love that. Logan's farmhouse specialty apple seeds. That is so cool. I just I absolutely adore this. I want to open them like so carefully. Cause the the fact that they're custom seed packs is just your creativity, you guys. Oh your creativity, your art, your your comments, your kindness. You guys are just so amazing. Oh, there they are. There they are. Some beautiful apple sleeves. I'll have to see if I can get anything from that. Can you imagine like spending the next 10 years nurturing this tiny little apple seed and I just take this tiny little apple tree everywhere I move and it blossoms into this big beautiful thing. Logan, thank you so much. I will do my best if you, if, oops, come here. My, my magic seeds. Magic beans. Gotcha. <laughs> I love that. I will do my best to write back to all of you who have given me uh, addresses to write back to. If you can't, don't stress. You've seen how excited and happy I am. You know that every single day I'm doing my best to try to give you guys more adventures and stories together to share. You guys are amazing. Oh, all right. And I have one more, and it's actually the biggest, <laughs> one more package that I have so far to open. And it's from Colorado, from Kenna. It's fragile, so I need to be very gentle with it. And I'm going to gently open it. We have a happy little sticker on the back. And see what is inside. It's very carefully, very, it has fragile written on it. It's very carefully packaged. The bubble wrap is secure. Can I just so you know? And then, oh, it's covered in cute stickers. I can't show you because it might show our address. Covered in cute stickers. Let's open up the back. See what's inside. Alright, here we go. Sorry the envelope is so big, I couldn't find any big enough to fit my drawings without folding them other than this. And sorry my writing is Don't you guys ever worry. And, oh my gosh! Kenna! My mother is a shell collector and she would be so jealous if she saw these. Oh my goodness, look at these. These are beautiful. Oh, I can't wait to put this on my specimen shelf. These are so pretty. Look at that one. And I have another one from Florida and another one from Idaho. <laughs> you guys are so amazing. So many amazing specimens. Oh my gosh. And let's see the drawings. Oh, and so you're in middle school. I'm, I'm going very, like, quickly over. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, no, don't, don't, you're not, don't 
isn't weird. This is beautiful. And I'm just not reading it out loud because most of the time when I do that, I hit the point in the letter where it's like, please don't read this out loud. And I'm like, whoops. So new policy is for me to skim it first. <laughs> Kenna, I am so happy. I love how when you wrote love, you put a little heart where the O is. Oh, and congratulations on having turned 13. And I hope your brother stays safe and thank him very much for serving our country because that's pretty amazing. And if you don't mind, I will show the fan art now. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Sunflower and Estuary Seed are definitely going to have to have a date. Look at that. And there's Trinity going get a room. That is so precious. Oh, and did you guys see Aster Seeds? Like, there's definitely a difference between the gold and the yellow in the two, and Aster Seed has his rainbow feathers. Oh my gosh. And then look at this one. It's the whole group. Oh, and Pine's drawn as a little baby puppy. Oh, wow, and that tree, and all of it, and the mushrooms, and the garden snail, and the moss on rocks, and the detail on everything. You are all so amazingly talented. You are all, you are all worth everything I can possibly give you. Inspiration, curiosity, compassion, love, all of that. You guys are so amazing. I am going to get to work on trying to organize everything so that I can reply to everybody as quickly as possible. And again, thank you. Thank you so much for your time, for your sense of curiosity and wonder about the natural world. And I cannot wait. I really cannot wait to see where we go from here. And I only hope that I can continue to strive to improve and to teach you more about what is out there in the world so that you can see what your natural heritage, what your natural right to explore and be curious and observe can offer you. So thank you so much everybody for the amazing gifts. I am like stunned. <laughs> I'm stunned. Thank you. Thank you everybody and remember to stay curious and I will see you guys all next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>